that's what I was going to say. Oh, I ate too much. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, let's enter the hut. Let's see if it looks the way I expect. Yep. Now there's no doubt about it. This could only be a witch doctor's hut. Okay. Hmm. It's somewhat reminiscent of a totem pole. If I'm not mistaken, it represents the spirits of their ancestors. <sighs> Remember reading that they were used for almost everything in some cultures. From cradles for babies to battle shields, and even in ceremonial outfits. Well, they are mu multi purpose. Well, it's probably some sort of shrine. Man, I'd take one of the items here in this little keepsake box, but I really don't see what I could do with a collection of dusty bones. These witch doctors sure have a funny way of organizing their pantries, from what I see. Don't really need any Hawaiian Tupperware right now, but I'll keep it in mind. Well, thank you. It looks like a primitive throne. Primitive and spooky, if you ask me. I wouldn't put it in my lip. Pile of bones. Well, that's hidden away good. Ah, oh, it's one of these little uh, scroll down or you miss everything screens. It's most likely used for religious ceremonies, like a baptismal font. Oh, I thought it said uh, uh, old bones or something. Okay. It's most likely. I don't think I'd be able to. But you can have a fucking. Ah, never mind. It's not that I'm afraid to, but what if it closes its mouth? You shut up. Put the bird on there. No, I'd rather keep it with me until Kai... Okay, whatever, let's go back and uh, talk to Kai then. Because now we know where it is. It's right here. Yeah, right there. Hi, Genkai. Aloha, Brian. What's up? Hey, I know where your grandpa's hut is now. You're pulling my leg, bro. How'd you find it? I remember it was practically impossible to reach. Hey, I've never been that bad an explorer, and you must admit my sense of direction is pretty darn good. On the basis of the data you gave me, I began to walk northeast. Paying proper attention to the direction of the sun's rays and using the reflections of the sunlight <laughs> off and the, the GPS. Of the guide. Little by little, the plant life differed. So I knew I was on the right path, thanks to the undulations the Pacific Nor'easter causes in the leaves. At one specific location, Damn, you can talk, I saw Ryan. that the spider webs shifted their concentric patterns for others more hexagonal. An unmistakable sign that I was approaching some sort of human settlement. In the end, I followed the flight path of the native crow, because you said there were some graves by the hut, and voila! There was the hut. You're one awesome bra. And to think that any other poser would have needed a GPS to find it. <laughs> uh, oh yeah, there are some real dimwits out there. The hut is located a few hours away, so let's get hopping. You'll have to hop on your own, bra. Without my prosthetic leg, I doubt I could get that far. Speaking of which, I found your prosthetic leg. Kawabunga, brah. Now you can get up from that hammock. Your butt must have a nasty hammock imprint by now. Uh, well, yeah. Actually, my other leg is totally asleep, too. Maybe I should keep meditating for a while, brah, to see if it wakes up. But hey, I owe you one. Actually, Damn why don't we server. go to your grandpa's hut to revive the parrot? All right, brah, but keep it cool. Hurring is for the weak of bladder and bad burglars. You can't imagine how many memories this brings back, brah. The throne, the tikis, the turtle shells. By the way, 
Did I tell you that my Kapuna discovered an underwater tunnel that goes beneath the island? Turns out the sea turtles pass through it to reach the lake and enjoy mating season. Cause... Kai, could you explain this to me some other day? If we wait too long, poor Aolani may end up with a terminal case of life ache. Hmm. Maybe you're right. Wait a sec. I'm gonna put on my working gear. <sighs> he's so lazy. Okay. He reminds me of me. Let's just hope he doesn't doze off while he's changing. Bad news, brah. Man, that was speedy. I can't find my Kapuna's grammarium anywhere. Grammarium? Yeah, his book of spells. That's where his poultry reviving spell is. So if we don't find it, I can't get Aolani to snap out of it. Maybe we should split up to search around. Alright, where do you want me to look? Hmm, I got it. You search the physical plane of existence, brah. And yeah, I'll explore the it. spiritual side. I'm gonna start meditating right away to see if I can find it. Man, is he a lazy bum or what? <laughs> well, better get down to searching. Yeah. Who didn't see this coming? Soldier O'Connor. So you sir. Rawr. Sir. I need you. The sun was shining in my eyes. This is just a stupid theory I'm trying out. Just in case you were wondering. I believe it's a weapons manual. I should have imagined. No, this is no time for a read. Plus... Okay, so that's not it. Yeah, it would be a pretty fucking lazy uh, thing if, if he also had the book we needed. But hey, can't blame a guy for trying, right? <coughs> So, to find a book, I'll try going back here. Oh, now we can look at what the hammock. What a great invention. A swing, bed, and cradle, all wrapped into one. So let's see. Sure. I'll get some Z's, let Aelani finish kicking the bucket. I'll slurp down some brewskis with Little Demon, and let someone else rescue Gina. Please. Right. <laughs> that girl that... Stuff happened to and something about plot and stuff. Okay, so book's not there. Let's see if it's no. Better not bug those two. It's not in there then. I doubt it's down here by the speedboat, but uh, we might as well try looking for it in uh, every nook and cranny, right? <laughs> It's pretty small, but I'm not... No. That's not it. Alright, it, it, it would be funky if it was in here, but let's just uh, try checking everything out anyways. Something with so many uses can't just be left here. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. You're it. I was thinking maybe I need those turtle shells. Maybe I can <laughs> shells. Maybe I can pick them up. But I thought better of it before. But uh, yeah. Don't really need any Hawaiian. But man, I'd take one of the eyes. But I really don't see what I. Maybe he'll have to stick Aolani in it when the time comes. I think it weighs too much. Yeah, I'll wake him up. <clears throat> uh, 
かい？